So good morning or good night, depending on where you are in the world, and welcome to another album review of The Shield Dude on a Couch. I'm your host, Hector, and today we're going to talk about the brand new album by Metal Church, and it's called Congregation of Annihilation. And this is the first album with a brand new singer, Mark Lopez, because back in 2021, uh, Mike Howe, the, their last singer, uh, died tragically of uh, asphyxiation. And uh, so they were left a, a big void to fill because he was a very charismatic singer. So Mark Lopez really fits in really well with the band. Uh, I listened to it and yeah, it sounds like Metal Church. And I always found the name Metal Church corny as fuck. <laughs> but yeah, uh, it's it fits with the band. So this is a new singer, same metal church, if you will. It's the band doing a continuation of what they've always done. You know, they have elements of fresh metal. They have elements of classic heavy metal, uh, great riffing, uh, over the top singing with the what? stuff like that you know that I can't do because I'm not a singer but Mark Lopez really does a great job in this album so this album it's it's pretty interesting it has uh, like nine to ten tracks and it's a normal run time to the 40 ish minute mark to 45 uh, there's a few bonus tracks in it but I'm I'm not gonna talk about the bonus tracks I'll talk about the tracks that are not bonus tracks so First of all, Making Monsters, which was the lead single that they picked for this release, is a great single, you know. Uh, it has, it, first of all, there's some great singing by Mark here, uh, some high pitch wailing, and there's a very like distinctive like guitar sound, because this band uh, has, I think, only one original member from the 80s. But that like style of riffing really sounds like that metal church sound and making monsters i i like that it's a fast-paced song and it's got the rhythm it, it it's like a gallopy type of rhythm like a like an iron maiden type of rhythm you know that you feel like you can move to it and groove so i thought that was a great introduction for the new album so the new album i think uh, it has some strong suits like i think it starts very strong with the first songs Another Judgment Day and Congregation of Annihilation are two great opening tracks. Uh, I like, uh, with Congregation of Annihilation, I like the, the chorus like, Congregation of Annihilation, it's, it sounds metal as fuck. And it's a fast paced song, and it's a song that really, uh, the chorus uh, gets stuck in your head and it's uh, very sing along too. Another Judgment Day starts the album with some great riffing, great drumming on this track, by the way. And it starts the album on a very, like, high pace. This is a high pace album, you know. This has no power ballads. It's an album that it's fast paced all the way through. Uh, then you have tracks like Pick a God and Pray, that that one sounded like more traditional heavy metal to me, uh, especially on the singing and the way that they're playing the guitar, not, a, not that much fresh metal. The first two are more fresh metal uh, sounding. Uh, songs that I didn't like that much, which I think were, were not bad, but they weren't as great, is Me The Nothing. I, I don't know, I, I found that track a little bit, uh, I don't know, kind of generic at times, and uh, I didn't, it didn't grab me that much. It's not bad, but it didn't grab me. Then you have, songs like Say a Prayer with Seven Bullets. Uh, and it's okay, you know, it's, it, it, it's, it's kind of predictable sounding uh, in the riffing, but it's, it's, non the, it's nonetheless bad. Uh, I think till the end of the album, some, uh, like the last songs, it can get a little bit repetitive at times. That doesn't say that it is not a bad album, but uh, it kind of, like sometimes it kind of lost me a little bit. But I think that the strong, uh, points of this album is uh, Mark Lopez did a great job uh, as a singer and really carries the the vocal void uh, that was left by Mike Howe so they didn't miss a step there but the negative to me is that maybe uh, it's it's just too same sounding sometimes and I, I, sometimes a little bit of variation would go a long way 
but you know it's it's metal church doing what they do it's a very it's a safe album you know for them uh they're not gonna change their sound at this time uh but yeah there's songs like i said that stand out more than others uh which are uh, another judgment day congregation of annihilation uh, pick your god and pray and making monsters those are the four tracks that i think are the best representation of this album but nonetheless, this is a solid release for the band, and I think a new chapter for the band, which is good. I, I gotta commend the band for keep keep going and, and do not, not giving up. And I think if you like heavy metal, traditional heavy metal and fresh metal, you will enjoy Congregation of Annihilation by Metal Church. So what did you think of this album? What are your favorite tracks? Comment, I would really wanna know. And what are your thoughts of Mark Lopez as the new lead singer for Metal Church? And of course, if you like the videos that I'm putting out, do not forget to give me a like and do not forget to subscribe. I have more content on the way. So tomorrow, join me and JC Rock and Metal Reviews and Tom the Green Man for another Is It That Bad? And we're talking about Six Feet Under. So I'll see you tomorrow. So until next time, people. This is Hector, the shield dude on a couch, and I'll see you right here on the couch. Thank you, and good night.